Welcome to Tesla Life Europe with news, tips, and great destinations to visit with your Tesla. This is episode 5. Tesla Autopilot is one of the most advanced self driving systems currently available to a large fleet of cars. Let me show you what it is capable of and why it improves traffic safety. It is a 15 km drive. Some city streets and some highway driving. It does not get more relaxed than with Tesla Autopilot doing the driving for you. Here I can already switch on Autopilot. As you can see, just an ordinary street, in an ordinary city, with cars turning, and many cars parked alongside the road. This trip is in a Tesla Model X, with enhanced autopilot, and hardware version 2.5. Here I have to switch off autopilot, because traffic lights are not yet recognized with software version 2020.24.6.4, in a car with hardware 2.5. But it is interesting to see, how autopilot has no problem even on this street without lane markings. Sometimes autopilot needs a car in front, to drive on streets without lane markings. However, I have been able to use autopilot here, even when there is no car ahead. And then the car is coming to a stop smoothly, without driver input. To go with the traffic again, as soon as the traffic light turns green. As you can see here, the bright sunlight in the camera, while we drive under the highway, does not pose a problem. From here, we will join the A13 highway towards Rotterdam. And, to add to the comfort, merging the highway will be automatically done by autopilot. Just a light press on the left turn signal stop to confirm the merge and the same to move over one more lane. From here, it is a relaxing and uncomplicated trip to Rotterdam. Autopilot takes care of all the steering, distance keeping and speed corrections. The car in front of us drives slowly. A light tap on the left indicator initiates a lane change, but not before autopilot check that we can safely take over. We are approaching Rotterdam. We have to take the right exit. Autopilot indicates that a lane change is upcoming. I tap the right indicator, to merge into the right lane for the upcoming exit. The car neatly adds behind other traffic. Also, if a car wants to insert from an adjacent lane, autopilot detects it, and slows down to allow the other car to merge. When entering Rotterdam, we decide to take a slightly different route to our destination, and I override the navigation. Autopilot indicates that it is ready to retake control. So, let's not resist.
As you can see here, quick changes from bright sunlight to shadow and back. Cause no problem for autopilot. Roundabouts are not yet supported by autopilot. So I take back the control of the car. A short tap on the braking pedal. A tap on the autopilot stop, or a small twist of the wheel is enough to regain control of the car. And we are back again in autopilot, on the city streets of Rotterdam. Approaching our destination. I hope you enjoyed the ride as much as I did. Please like the video, and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for your support and thanks for watching. That's it for now. Meanwhile stay safe, and stay tuned, and please click subscribe to be notified of new videos.